what's going on everybody welcome back to the rough effect i'm your host jay and today we're diving into diablo 4. now the beta is coming up this weekend and i want to get you guys prepared so i'm going to go through the standard edition the lux edition and the ultimate edition for you guys today to see exactly what fits your needs and your budget so starting off we're going to dive right into the standard edition and it costs you around 74 to 76 dollars and all you're getting is wings and a murloc pet in diablo 3 a rage mount a world of warcraft winged darkness cosmetic set in diablo immortals you get absolutely nothing within the standard edition for diablo 4 which is freaking crazy if you want to just pay 75 dollars for the standard edition because the other two editions are actually pretty pricey what the fuck is this piece of shit but i'm gonna tell you right now they're more worth it so on a budget right now, I would suggest the Digital Deluxe Edition because you get everything that's included within the Standard Edition, but finally you get some bonuses for Diablo 4, and that is the 4 Days Early Access, and Diablo 4 is a big bonus for me, especially with trading now back in Diablo. If you want to get ahead of it, maybe you can make some extra money just because of those 4 extra days. And then you get the seasonal battle pass where you don't have to buy it separate anyway. Where in the standard edition, you're probably going to have to buy it if you don't pick the digital deluxe edition. So that's nice to know. Then you get the Temptation Mountain Diablo 4, which looks pretty cool. It's at least a cosmetic finally for Diablo 4 if I'm putting money towards it. And then you get the Hellborn Mount Armor set. So you're technically getting four things for Diablo 4 within the deluxe edition, which is nice to finally see if I'm going to be spending around $89.99. So it's going to be roughly around $96 but then you could go even one step further with the unlimited edition you will receive everything within the standard edition and the deluxe edition plus get the accelerated season pass and this pretty much means that you're going to be able to skip 20 levels within the season pass. What is unique about this one that you're spending an extra $15 pretty much is the Wings of the Creator emote. Which is probably a emote that's not even going to be cool. This is what $115 gets you guys. A little emote that goes... Oh. So... What edition I would honestly pick would be the Digital Deluxe Edition just because you get the 4 days early access, get ahead of everybody else. And that's pretty much all I have for you guys today. Write down in the comments what edition did you decide to buy and why. Also, if you enjoyed this video, hit that like button and don't forget to subscribe. And if you guys are still unsure about playing Diablo's beta, I suggest you guys clicking on this video right here. It'll tell you everything you need to know why you should be playing the upcoming beta for Diablo 4. Other than that, I'll catch you guys on my next video. See ya!